A major bombshell dropping overnight from former FBI Director James Comey. And now he says there is evidence that the president could be guilty of obstruction of justice. Anna Carrera is in studio with us this morning. It really kind of goes all the way back to the president's first few months in office where he's talking about this. Yeah, it really does. Good morning, Ben and Julia. Comey talks about a meeting that he had with President Trump from last February. Now He says the president asked him to drop the FBI's investigation of Michael Flynn. Flynn, you may remember, had just resigned as the national security advisor. Now, in talking about that interaction, Comey says there was, quote, certainly some evidence of obstruction of justice. But he also says any criminal charge would be up to a prosecutor. And president Trump has denied that happened. The president also denied asking Comey for loyalty during a private dinner, as we talked about in the last hour. Now, yesterday on Twitter, he said this is just another of Comey's many lies. The former FBI director, though, remembers it differently. But the purpose of the dinner was for him to extract from me a promise of loyalty. So he asks you what you want, then says what he wants. He said, I expect loyalty, I need loyalty. And I just stared at him and had this little narrative with myself inside saying, don't you move, don't you dare move, don't even blink. After all of this, you might think Comey would want President Trump to be impeached, but he says that's not really the case. He says that would actually let the American people off the hook. He says they should take their values, take them to the polls, and actually make a change moving forward, seeing what they have seen so far. Of course, the book dropping officially tomorrow, so people will get their chance to hear much more from Mr. Comey. Anna, thanks for a preview, though. We appreciate it.